Hey fifth graders, well, former fifth graders. Uh, this is a video to all of my former students at West Hills, um, not just from this past year, but all the years previously. So by now you may have heard that uh, next year I'm not gonna be teaching at West Hills anymore. I was really excited to teach in middle school when I found out that I got the job. Uh, and I was really disappointed when I found out that the leadership team of the school said that they decided that I should stay in fifth grade instead. And unfortunately, they told me that after the last day of school. So like I said, I was really disappointed. And after I was... Okay, you go. After I got the news, I went home, talked to Jen, friends and family, and prayed about it and we felt really strongly about making the decision to not teach at West Hills anymore because I feel like God is really calling me to teach in public school now and I am positive that God is going to work this out for good. I just wish that I could have said goodbye to you before I took down all my Pez dispensers and before I emptied my classroom and before the last day of school. So this is my goodbye video to you. Speaking of Pez dispensers, I want to thank you guys so much for all of the silly little dispensers that you have given me over the seven years that I taught in fifth grade. Without you guys, I would not have gotten my collection up to 1,000 dispensers. That was a big milestone this year, is when we reached 1,000 dispensers. I will definitely put them up in my new classroom in whatever school that is, I don't know yet. And every time that I look at those on the wall, I will think of all you guys, all of the students in my past who have contributed to the huge wall of Pez. Thank you so much guys for all the smiles and the skits and the funny dances and the bloopers and... Baby's resting. Thank you so much for all the fifth grade goofiness that I was able to capture on film for the music videos. It was so much fun. I keep going back and watching those videos year after year, always enjoying those memories of us. Thank you so much for helping me to become a better teacher. Every single year that I taught at West Hills, I learned something new from you in order to help me become a better teacher. I'm gonna take that growth that I learned when I was teaching you guys, and I'm gonna to continue to grow as I look for a job in public school. You know I've talked about it many times in class, whether it was my own kids' public school, or neighborhood house, or just loving our neighbors that are all around us. We talked about the invisible girls and boys all throughout the city of Portland. And we talked about all the hurting that goes on all around us. And I believe that God is calling me to represent Him in my own neighborhood here in East Portland. And I'm really excited about it. And I would really appreciate it if you guys could pray for me as I continue to listen to Jesus, as I look for a job, and as I do my best with my future as I try to please Him. So again, I really wish that I could have said goodbye to you guys in person, but you know, God doesn't always work the way that we want him to. And I will definitely come back to visit, I promise. I want to come back and see you, those of you that are still there, and come say hi. I love you guys so much, and I will miss all of you as I move on. Oh, and by the way, I know that there are some parents who are organizing an ultimate frisbee game at Gabriel Park in a few weeks. I'm not sure exactly what date, and we're going to have a frisbee game and popsicles and fun and uh, hopefully I'll get to see you there if you want to come and we can play and say goodbye in person. So I hope to see you there and if not I'll see you guys again whenever I come back to visit. So uh, have a great summer guys. I love you and I'll miss you.